for Sparta Prague versus Liverpool, the first leg. Run down the wing for me. Da, 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 da. What's everyone worrying about? We're the best team in the world. Mo Salah warming up. Hopefully he's ready for Sunday. No! Oh, to go! Are we going to win it all? It's going up against Ireland on Sunday. I can do whatever I want. <laughs> Canate is injured. Right, so we are at Stansted Airport, a very, very early start. It's absolutely freezing. I think I should have packed more layers to be honest. We're on the way to Prague for TNT Sports Foreign Exchange Programme. Really excited to get amongst it with the Prague locals and really experience what Prague is like as an away day. And there's a big game to be played as well. We need to get this first leg out of the way so we can go back to Anfield and you know, hopefully get to the final. I think it's time to go and check in. Let's go, lad. Oh, get in there Reds, massive day ahead. So we're gonna to go to the hotel, check in, and, uh, and get amongst it. Right, we're in the cab on the way to the hotel. The president, I believe it's called, very fitting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> but yeah, listen, we're with, uh, with my man Josh from um, Pitch Marketing. And who do you support, mate? I'm a Chelsea fan, it's tough to say these days. Are you still reeling after Wembley, or are you over that? I think I was over it before it happened, mate. Oh, I, yeah. I knew it was going. I think I knew it was going to happen. You know I actually really like pessimistic Chelsea fans. I think <laughs> they're the best ones. So, big up to Josh, man. So I just got a text in a group, um, a Liverpool fan group, that apparently there's a tractor slash farmer demonstration today that is uh, making big traffic disruptions. Apparently, all the farmers have had enough, mate. That's not a tractor. What are you doing here, you fraud? Right, we've just arrived at the President Hotel in Prague. We've got a nice couple of hours to do our own thing, explore a bit, and then we're heading for lunch with Lucas, the Sparta Prague fan. But it's great to be here. What a beautiful city. Very, very amazing architecture. I'm impressed. Right, we're outside Hillbilly Burgers to meet Sparta Prague fan Lucas. He's going to give us a bit of the emotional context around what it means for Sparta Prague to play a game like tonight against a team like Liverpool. And I am absolutely starving and I'm hearing the burgers are very good. Ahoy, bracho. Ahoy. How nice are to you, meet you Alex. Good to see nice you. Nice to meet you. Good to see you. Thanks for having us in the beautiful city of Prague. Yeah. Can't wait. Yeah. Big Sparta Prague fan. Yeah, as you can see. As you can see. This listen. is this is old logo, to be honest. We've got new ones now. New and improved. <laughs> yeah. Well, listen, are you hungry? Yes. Shall we go in there and talk about football? Definitely. Go on, let's go for it. So, Lucas, thanks for having us. Yeah, it's an you're absolute welcome. pleasure to be here. Um, really excited to watch the game tonight. Sparta Prague, unbeaten at home as well. Yes. Unbeaten at yes. home as well. Yes. Definitely. So it's going to be a very very tough game for Liverpool tonight. Definitely. We're going to lose, guys. <laughs> going to lose <laughs> going that to confident yeah 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 what score yeah because you know this is a fortress this stadium up there we're gonna go uphill it's absolute fortress oh my god not a very warm welcome um <laughs> listen unbeaten at home it is a fortress yeah but liverpool yeah. unbeaten at home you know we've only lost one or two games this season hopefully we, we want to win the europa league you are favorites of course yeah we are underdogs and uh, the main thing here today is to get a result for us because at Anfield we we have no chance. <laughs> <laughs> so hang on, he's saying we could, they're going to batter us tonight, but Anfield no chance. So that should be a decent game, man. I'm looking forward to it. Um, getting inside the stadium, finding about how emotional the fans are going to be, knowing that Liverpool come into town as well. It's a big yeah. game for both yeah. teams, but especially for Sparta Prague. Definitely for Sparta Prague. You know, it's uh, it's enormous. You are top of the league, we are top of the league, but kind of different competition. Yeah, I know, different league. But uh, I think it's going to be a fantastic game. Okay, well, speaking of fantastic, I'm absolutely starving. Yeah. What do you recommend here at Hillbilly Burgers? What can well, I have? Well, I always go for Hillbilly Burger. 
<laughs> just just straight up, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Liverpool players walking around in fog. Yeah. Clock. Clock four. Yeah. Clock four. My Salah's there. Virgil, Darwin, yeah. La Pantera. <laughs> in front of the goal, yeah, definitely Pantera. Are you, well, more, are you more nervous now that you've seen the Liverpool players uh, walking around? Oh, definitely not, guys. Definitely <laughs> not. Yeah. Confidence. <laughs> Beaming off of Lucas. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Mo Salah. Is he the one that you're like, I can't wait to see him yes. on my pitch, the yes. fortress? Yes, definitely. Yeah, yeah Mo Salah is just incredible. Yeah. You are so fortunate to have him. Klopp, you know, Salah, Trent, he's not here obviously, yeah. but uh, he's incredible Trent. I like Trent so much, you know, with his now kind of uh, inverted role, yeah. it's incredible. It is. I think he's insane. It is. Yeah. If you could sign one player for Sparta Prague, who would it be? Who would it be? Probably Trent. Probably even Trent. though, Even though Salah is my favorite, he's kind of old now, you know, <laughs> I would sign Trent. Tell us who we should look out for tonight. Who's the danger men for Prague? Who can hurt Liverpool at the Fortress, as you say? Uh, you know, we have some injuries, uh, but I guess they will start. You know, Araslin and Birmančević. Those mm. are two absolute danger men. You heard it. Let's hope they don't score tonight, eh? Salivating. Oh, God. Mm. Wow, the crunchiness of the bacon mixed in with the kind of medium cooked beef. Unbelievable. That is a 9.3 out of 10. Mm, that's pretty good. It's not bad, that, that's is it? That's pretty good, yeah. I'll take that. Get that. Tastes great. Just like how three points are going to taste later on. <laughs> well, it's not really three points, is it? It's a knockout game. So, idiot. Oh, my friend, that hit the spot. Yeah. I'll tell you what, Patrick Berger would be proud of that. Definitely. Hey, hey, get it? Burger? Hillbilly? And it was this. I'm not going to say this word because we'll get demonetized, but it was. It is true. It was. So, right, we've got food in us. We've had a drink. Show us around the city a bit more, man. No problem. Let's go. So what do you think about Prague? Do you know what? It's a beautiful city, very colourful. I love the trams. Yeah. I love the architecture, the water, obviously a beautiful river here. Yep. A very good place, man. I, I'm impressed. It's a very cosmopolitan, European, historic city. But you know, the main attraction is the city centre. And Slavia Prague. Slavia Prague, definitely. Yeah, we love them. Yeah, for sure. Would you compare it to some England city? Blackburn? <laughs> Blackburn! No, joking, Thanks! <laughs> Outside the E-Pet Arena. One more time, shout out to the Foreign Exchange crew at TNT Sports and Discovery. The only place to catch every single European match live. Click the link down below to sign up. You can't go wrong. Otherwise, you're going to miss out on games like this. What, is, what does this mean? Well, this means uh, the wolf doesn't care what a uh, sheep thinks. The sheep oh, means... Are you calling Liverpool sheep tonight? Uh, no, 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 I'm no, fine no, with no, Liverpool. Yeah. This is against Slavia, you know. <laughs> it's, everything is against Slavia. Man United Slavia. and Slavia. Uh, this stadium is pretty old. Uh, I think it's around 50 years old, maybe even more. Uh, my whole family is uh, Sparta, Slavia Prague fans, so I'm just uh, one of the kind in my family. How does that work on Derby Day? Yeah, it works perfectly because they're losing a lot <laughs> recently. So I'm more than happy, you know. But the Derby's, it's, uh, it's a special, special, special day for the family. So uh, let's actually get your score prediction then. Hope free one. <laughs> and what I think is 2-1 uh, Sparta Prague win. Okay. I believe we can do so it. So what I hope? Yeah. 2-0. 2-0. What for I Sparta. think. Okay. No, Liverpool. Fair no, enough. Relax. Yeah, yeah, okay. And what I think. 4-0 Liverpool. No, I'm joking. <laughs> no, no, it's a joke. It's a four joke. Nil. No, I, I genuinely think we could win 2-1 tonight. I'd be happy with that. Yeah, I'd be really, uh, really happy with that. Yeah, What's your yeah. famous song? 
Sparta, Prague. Yeah, da, da, yeah. Da. <laughs> Is that how it goes? Yeah, yeah. Sparta means uh, like uh, the warriors, you know, from 300, the movie, strong, you know, never ever give up. See the bar, right? Yeah. Nice to see you, man. Fucking hell, it's a bit intimidating in here, I can't lie. So, Lucas, we're outside the local bar. What would happen if I zipped down my jacket and revealed my Liverpool hat? <laughs> I believe uh, that nothing would happen, but I wouldn't try. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's a no then. Let's move on. Are you confident? Do you think you can beat Liverpool, one of the best teams in Europe? I think we can beat Liverpool. I think Sparta will play, yes. Sparta will win. Yeah. Liverpool is a lot of big, amazing team, but Sparta has a heart and a desire. Liverpool is a massive, uh, big club, but uh, Sparta has a heart and uh, a passion. The pubs are starting to get a lot busier as we approach kick-off time. The lads are drinking there, they're, they're confident. And why wouldn't they be? Don't blame them. But, you know, I can finally show my Liverpool hat. Where is it? Get in there, boys. All right, keep my nut down, keep my nut down. <laughs> Look who I've gone and bumped into. Hi. It's only Mr. Paul Machin from uh, the Red Men TV. How are we, fella? Tired. Me too. But good, but good, excited. I have got this gut feeling that Liverpool draw tonight and at the weekend. Listen, we live in hope, anything's possible. City's the big one, so for me, and the, the distance I've gone to get here, I need a win. Um, but as far as like constructing a season goes, Got to take them to Armfield and batten them regardless. It's Ronnie! Yes, Ron! How are we, fella? Very good, take a seat. Oh, yeah, I will. Long time no see. Yeah, good to see you. Do you like coming to these kind of stadiums and do you like the Europa League kind of journeys? Yeah, different places. I've been to Madrid seven times, yeah, six, seven times. Six or seven times, you get a bit you know, and Milan, I still like going to Milan just because yeah. I like Milan and the, the town, but um, no, this unique, is good. You know, different. Definitely. 3-1. 3 one. Yeah, I'll go for 3-0. 3-0? Lucas, look, he's, he's shaking his head. <laughs> yeah. he, think, know. he thinks 2-0 yeah. to them. Oh, he may, yeah, of course he does. He's yeah. a, he's a it, Sparta yeah. supporter. Yeah. You support your team, that's the way it is. <laughs> cool. This is the team to take on Sparta Prague. Kelleher in goal, Joe Gomez, um, Quantar, Robertson and Connor Bradley at the back for Liverpool. Endo, McAllister and... Um, Gakpo in midfield with Elliot Diaz and Nunez. That's a strong team. And on the bench, Adrian Van Dijk, Soboslai, Salah makes the bench, Simakas, Gordon, McConnell, Kumas, Bradley. I like it. I'm a fan. Here with the main man, the man that's played for both clubs, Patrick Berger. What a legend. <laughs> yeah, I was lucky to, uh, to be able to be part of uh, such a two big clubs so as Sparta Prague and Liverpool. So, you know, I'm, uh, I'm very proud of that. Listen, I'm a big Liverpool fan. My friend Lucas here is a big Sl uh, Slavia. I was about to say Slavia. Sparta Prague. Sparta Prague fan. He's very confident. He thinks they're going to beat yeah, Liverpool yeah. tonight. We're going to win. Yeah. Confidence is a good thing, mate. You know, I wouldn't be able to make it uh, without the confidence. So, uh, <laughs> I mean, the, he can be confident as much as he wants, but, uh, you know, the, the boys still have to do it on the pitch. So, who do you support tonight? I mean, I have, uh, I have heart in both teams, but... Uh, you know, I have been in Liverpool for seven years, you know, I, I, that, that was the main main part of my career. So, I mean, I, I cheer for Liverpool a little bit more than for Sparta Prague. Are you happy with this? Oh my, no. How could you? <laughs> <laughs> I can do whatever I want. <laughs> Listen, incredible to see you. Enjoy Don't the game and I'll you. see you soon, All brother. Best. Take All care. Best. I loved your hat-trick against uh, Chelsea, by cheers, the way. Cheers, yeah? Cheers. What a guy. Cheers, yeah. Cheers. yeah. Well, look, here come Liverpool. Liverpool fans clapping the Liverpool players onto the pitch. So we're going to see the players training now. This is going to be fun. Maybe a couple of balls fly over. I can test out my touch, ping it back to them. You never know. I might even get a shout for the second half. Who knows? You can't rule anything out when you've got foreign exchange pitch side access on TNT and Discord. <laughs> Man like Ronnie, you can see him in the crowd. That's who we were speaking to him earlier. Yes, Ronnie. Do the Jürgen fist pump to man like Ronnie. Come on. Come on, the boys.
My guy, Mo Salah on the pitch. Jurgen Klopp on the pitch. My brother. Klopp always stands on the halfway line, isn't it? To uh, stare down his opponents before the game, to intimidate them and see what their tactics are, as you can see. Looking straight at them. Straight at them. But the ultras enjoy that. They're giving it back. The atmosphere is really building, you know. Mo Salah warming up. Hopefully he's ready for Sunday against Man City. I have to say, looks, uh, I mean, I saw him running around Duke Street filming an advert for Pepsi last week and he looked fit then. So hopefully he comes on tonight and gets uh, 20, 25 minutes ready for Sunday. It's Jarrell! Big up, man. Hey, listen, they booed Liverpool when they came out. So it's only right. That is impressive, though. The ultras are really making some noise behind that goal. <laughs> Straight to Nunes. Oh, and Harvey Elliott touches it. We love to see it. Big up to Harvey. Yeah, and a little nod there from Harv. He's obviously acknowledging the insane little zipped ball that I just sent over to him. We love to see it. Never seen Adrian take a corner before. Let's see what he's about. Not the best corner. Yeah. <laughs> Suerte, chico, vamos. Vamos. Spanish, so. Right. We better win this, because I'm getting a bit nervous now. I can't lie to you. 45 seconds away from kickoff. You know what? They've got the flares out. They're making a, a real racket. You're not allowed flares in, in England, in the Prem. We'd be getting thrown out if we did that. But Lucas said they're illegal here as well, so I don't know. But they are loud. Right, we've kicked off. We are underway finally. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh, oh we got scored. Yes. A minute and a half in. Darwin's got to be finishing that. Come on, man. We got a pen. We got a pen, I think. Is that a pen? It's a pen. Yeah. Fucking get it. We've got a penalty. Five, less than five minutes in. I think it will go to VAR. No, I, I, I don't get it. <laughs> Why? It's not a penalty. Alexis McAllister has a penalty for Liverpool. Five and a half minutes in. The boos are deafening. But this is a golden chance for Liverpool. Early on. Come on, Ali Maka. Come on, Maka. Save it, Peter. The whistle has been blown. The boos are Save deafening. It. Ali Maka steps up. Uh -huh. Yeah! So, so not cool. Come on! Turn. So Alexis McAllister has just scored a penalty five minutes in. The noise hasn't stopped. That won't stop. I but said it will end up 2-1. So here's so your, your goal. So your score still on? Yeah. So we're just fine. We're okay. Just fine. Well. Yeah. All right. Well, the ref needs to get a bit of control in this game. He's given them some soft free kicks here. Liverpool breaking, La Pantera. Oh, your boy, he's injured. Yeah, I hope he's not injured. <laughs> Come on, man, get out. Oh, shit. No. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We were caught sleeping at the back there. The ball comes across. Joe Gomez is nowhere to be seen. And it's an incredible save again from my bro, Quivi and Keller. And then Joe Gomez clears it off the line. It's everything against us. It's <laughs> just the referee. Oh, he's the 15 minutes in. He's already moaning about the ref. <laughs> you know what? Since Liverpool scored the pen, it's been all Sparta proud. What a block by Ibu Pinate. Tell you what, though. It's only a matter of time before Sparta Prague equalised. Oh, what to save again, Cleveland Kelleher. He's keeping us in this game even though we're 1-0 up. Oh, brother. Oh, brother. Your brother. My brother. He's doing some magic. Yeah. It's a, it's a good Irish goalkeeper there, by Come on, Darwin. Shoot. <gasps> oh! Golazzo, vamos! What 
extra goal by Darwin Nunez. Oh. Darwin Nunez has just scored an absolute screamer. Yeah. They're throwing stuff at him. Oh my god. Yeah. That was pretty cool. Yeah. That was pretty cool. What a goal for Darwin admit, Nunez. Yeah. What a nice goal. Oh my Get in, god. man. Get in. Come on, boys. Just what we needed. We were under the cosh. Hey, shit, Sandy Carroll, eh? Well, I'm a bit disappointed because we had so many chances. And now we're losing 2 0. Yeah, it's a bit unfair, to be honest. Hey, listen, man. Life's good? unfair. Yeah, remember that. Life lesson. Nothing's fair in life. How did they miss there? We have got away with something tonight, I tell you. This is a crazy game. This could genuinely be like 3-3 after 36 minutes. No, 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 one of our defenders again. Oh my God. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, this looks bad. Stand up, man. <laughs> oh, he's coming off. I think he's made the signal. To come. I'm not liking how easy it is for them to, to be one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. I know Keller is great in one-on-one -on -one situations, but this is too... I mean, we're two nil up, for God's sake, in a European away day. For Sunday. Stop, will you stop going on about Sunday? Basically, Jason, the cameraman, is an Arsenal fan, and he keeps going on about Man, Man City and Sunday. We're watching this game, mate, yeah? I, I know you're hoping for Sunday. Yeah, you ain't going to win the league either, worried about. Neither of us are, all right? Three nil. Oh my God! Oh, yeah. What a save, man. Oh, what a goal! Oh my God, Nunes is taking the piss, mate. What a goal from Darwin Nunes, 3-0 before half-time. Nick a goal. Mo Salah, oh. I told you Mo would come on and score. That is the tie done. 5-1 people. Mo Salah scores. 10 minutes after coming on. European goal from Mo Salah. All he needs is 10 minutes and he gets his goal. He disallowed the goal. Apparently it's offside. So no goal. 4-1. Soboslai 5-1. Great finish. Game tie over. Obviously Mo had that fifth goal disallowed but we should be 6-1. Good draw you know tonight. It could have been about 8 or 9 or 4. Which is a testament to Sparta Park. Their fans have been incredible. But Dominic Sobosla, I think that's his first European goal for Liverpool. Wraps off the game. Tie. Can't ask for a better night than that. Really. How are you feeling brother? 5-1. Yeah. yeah, I'm happy it's not 5-0 to be honest, but uh, the result is cruel. I think uh, we played really well and the uh, result doesn't reflect what we could see on the on the pitch. Some of the best seats in the house here, thanks to TNT, we've had an amazing night. Incredible seats, really, the experience has just been top. So I can't thank them enough. Let's go and win it all. Right, Liverpool fans are coming out of the ground after a 5-1 win. Oh, what a result, eh? Nick, fantastic result, mate. Liverpool, la la la, Liverpool! Liverpool, la la la, Liverpool! 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 La la la, Liverpool! Liverpool! This team haven't lost at home this season and Liverpool have just done that. Well, we don't, we don't, we don't lose. lose. Oh, shit. We've lost, like, what is it, two games all season, so we just don't lose. Up oh, the fucking heads. Are we going to win it all? Dollar, literally dollar. Are we going to beat City bring, on Sunday? Bring Ariggy back. 
Bring a Rigi back. That's a weird shout. That. We're swatting. No, we're swatting them Sunday. You reckon? Yeah. Enzo. What about Kanate Ken though, off. man? Come off. Kwanzaa. Fair enough. You got that confidence in Kwanzaa if Kanate's injured for Sunday. So they've lost their first game at home this season. Yeah. They've lost as many they, games. They've as not lost all season. Then we roll it's into town and put five past them. What's everyone worrying about? We're the best team in the fucking world. What's everyone worrying about? We are the best team in the fucking world. What's everyone worrying about? Oh, Genuinely. Nice. I'm over the moon. Talk to me about Darwin Nunes tonight. Nah, he's the boy, isn't he? He's Nunes, just a boss, isn't he? Nunes! 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 Canate, maybe there's an injury there tonight. Him, so. yes, oh yeah, he's on the You're better looking, looking than Haaland, mate. That's all right. You're we better are. looking than Haaland. He's just Thank you. There he is, it's the Dockey, Dockey, Dockey. Score predictions for Sunday. Get him to bed. Score predictions. 2-1, 2-1 Liverpool. Who scores? 2-2, 2-2. 3-1. 3-1. Endo scoring. Dockey, Dockey. By the way, Endo. I, 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 Some boy in I've it. not He's seen him put a foot out. wrong, boys. He's the best. This kid. He's, he's, he's better than Rodri. Endo's the boy. Endo is the boy. Endo better than Rodri, yeah? Tom, he's not, he's not, but you know what I mean? He's, he's just not, though, is he? Rodri is the best. 100%. In the world. We're going to win. So I, don't, I, don't, I don't care about the score. We're going to win 100%. Two to one, the bookies. Just run down the wing for me. Da, 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 da. This is what it's all about, these European away days. Well, there you go, man. That is. Some away day. I cannot believe the scoreline. It could have been more. Fans are obviously jubilant. It's one of those games that I'm going to remember forever. Not only for the Liverpool performance, but their fans as well were just incredible. Um, right, it's been a long day. I'm not going to lie to you. It's been a very long day from start to finish. It's time to get some food, go back, probably have a bath, and, uh, and it's back to the northwest of England tomorrow where we go into the big game against Man City on Sunday. Really looking forward to that. And uh, yeah, take care of the Reds. Okay. Yeah, it's a massive shout out to TNT. Don't forget, you can watch it all on Discovery Plus. Use the link in the description to, to join in the fun. Don't miss a kick. And we'll see you next time. Take care. I hope you've enjoyed it. Smash that like button and subscribe.